Let's talk about release. Um, release is it's kind of my tribute to therapy. And there's a point in my life where I I feel like, oh, um, so somebody said it better to me, and I, I can't uh, think of who at the moment, but he said that we grow up having these emotions that we uh, are meant to deal with any which way, but we don't grow up with any of the emotional intelligence to accompany it. So you are expressing these emotions without the proper articulation. And so when you are dealing with certain things, you might express that in the form of drinking a little bit too much or uh, you know, being promiscuous or uh, engaging in possibly harmful uh, behaviors that uh, cause your life to go down a path that you may not intend. And so it was really important to me to get some articulation around emotions, to be able to express them in a, in a proper, healthy way. I think we were all struggling pretty well uh, during the pandemic, uh, particularly around the murder of George Floyd. And I was having a time. And there was a, one of my coworkers, mentors, um, who encouraged me to share my story. And uh, I had not been, it's not something that I tended to do in a professional setting is share personal stories or information. Um, but in this case, I decided to take him up on that, and because it was a, it was a, it was a time, and I'll never forget. Like I was expressing myself, and the emotion is just right here, right in the throat. And I, I remember talking about my experience with police officers, and when I was a teenager, being pulled over four times uh, over the course of three months, feeling like there's just a lot of opportunity for things to go wrong in those scenarios. Not only that, having a brother who is a black man and a father, um, cousins and, and other relatives. It was interesting in sharing my story, I was really able to, I was able to show up lighter uh, than I had been able to previously. And I said, huh, maybe there's something to that. Um, expressing yourself and being able to talk to somebody. So I had known for a while that I wanted to engage in therapy at a time, but it was a, you know, it's a process to when you're ready and when you need it, different things of that nature. Um, but I was all of the above by the time I found, <laughs> by the time I found a therapist. And it was really beneficial for me. Um, I think a lot of times as black men, we don't have the, the space. There's not necessarily a space um, or time to be able to talk about your feelings because people would rather you not have the home to be able to sit down and feel what you feel can sometimes be a luxury. So I feel fortunate in that respect that I was able to take the time to investigate that. So that's what release is about. It's just about being with yourself, sitting, breathing, speaking, you know, the truth, sharing your story, and gaining a better understanding of yourself and others along the way in the process.